time for another living room makeover because she's feeling a little dull and she just needs some contrast. So we're gonna begin by adding this gallery wall. I got these cutie little sconces. Can you even with this bubble pleat on the shade? It is so beautiful. I'm doing some shadow box trim using these $5 eight foot molding sticks that I found at Lowe's and these miter snips, which made the process go 10 times faster. Highly recommend you get these and make sure you cut your angles at a 45 for a seamless corner cut. I used a brad nailer and just covered the holes with spackle and then I painted over it with the same color as my walls, which are agreeable gray by Sharon Williams. I found this reclaimed coffee table and the scalloped antique side table from Facebook Marketplace, which was just a blessing, truly. I styled these and cleaned up a bit, which was silly because my kids will mess this up in seconds. But now we're putting these custom linen curtains up by Chad made. I went with the taupe color and I am so glad I did because it makes this whole space feel so warm and cozy. But here is the end result. This was such an easy DIY and added so much character to our home. So yay, follow along for more doable home rentals like this.